Five times Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. All right, here we go. So the magician pops up first. This is also you, also a sign of Gemini too. But you're saying that you are using all of the tools in your shed, up in your head. Uh, and maybe, bitch, up in your bed to get things going and done instead. So the magician manifesting. Um, I wanted to say manifesting, manipulating making things ever-changing, being as or dealing with the Queen of Pentacles, so the woman who is, you know, very independently wealthy, responsible, reliable, structured, stable, and dependable, right? Okay, you can come out just be quiet. Um, leading you to the Six of Cups here, so just being shown that to you through um, communication. It's going to be communicated to you. Are you serious? So it will be communicated to you. Um, uh, are you in the corner? Yes. Um, through your emotions, basically, is what I wanted to get out for stuttering for about 10 seconds. Hey, okay. Because you are wishing upon a star for something, also a sign of Aquarius. So either wishing for an Aquarius or wishing upon a star for something. Um, and it's going to come to you. This what you're wishing about is this third party energy this three of cups doesn't necessarily have to be a third party negative situation but just saying that you're up in your mind about a third about an energy of three you know three people one plus two makes three and you but anyways so and this is for the month of july and on stop that because we do have a little bit of a battle here a little bit of a conflict a little bit of a conversation a little bit of a can you stop Sagittarius, we have some conflict here, a little bit of a battle, a battle has been fought, or is being fought, argumentation, um, but it's going to come back around to you, and what's also going to come back around to you is pentacles, money, wealth, earth, earthly, material, wealthy things, with this A coming back around to you, the ebb and flow, um, as it goes, as a person, Virgo Taurus Capricorn, um, a Virgo Taurus Capricorn may as well be coming back around to you. And as I said that, I also have the King of Pentacles in my hands here, my dear. So Virgo Taurus Capricorn as a man, you know, this is the earth sign. It's very boring. Oh, did I say boring? I mean, very reliable, structured, dependable, stable, secure, business owners and bosses. And I am the whore. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Anyways. So we're almost done here because we have to pass two minutes, but what's coming to you is a little bit of a found quickly is your foundation and your stability. Um, also being brought to you by, also being brought to you by your angels. This is your public PSA. The four archangels, uh, who do we got? We got Raphael, number one is Michael. We have, I don't know who else they named, Gabrielle, and then another one. I don't know which one they picked for the four. But this energy will be moving towards you, and although it will be moving towards you, maybe not that quickly. Things take time, and time takes time, and time, and things take time to manifest in the physical, material, wealthy realm. But you will get there with the Ten of Pentacles sitting right in my hand. So have no fear; the end is close, my dear. With the Ace of Cups, your eye on something new, something you love, and something that you are going to be emotional about and have attachments to. All right, so that's it for the fire signs. Or if you're a stalker watching it for one year, girl, do you can't invade them. Please elevate yourself, like, share, and subscribe if you give a fuck. If not.